First Chronicles chapter 6. Levi's sons were Gosh- Gershon, Kohath, and Merari. Kohath's sons were Amram, Ishar, Hebron, and Uzziel. Amram's children were Aaron, Moses, and Miriam. Aaron's sons were Nadab, Abihu, Eliezer, and Ithamar. Eliezer was Phine- Phinehas's father. Phinehas was Abishu- Abishua's father. Abishua was Buki's father. Buki was Uzi's father. <laughs> Uzi was Zeruiah's father. Zeruiah was Meroith's father. Meroith, Mirai, oh my goodness, Meraioth, Meraioth, Meraioth. Oh, there we go, Meraioth. Sorry, <laughs> I've done a rabbit hole. Was, okay, Miriam's, whatever, was Amariah's father. Amariah was Ahitub's father. Ahitub was Zodak's father. Zodak was Ahimaaz's father. Ahimaaz was Azariah's father. Azariah was Johanan's father. Johanan was Azariah's father. Azariah is the one who served as priest in the temple that Solomon built in Jerusalem. Azariah was Amariah's father. Amariah was Ahitub's father. Ahitub was Zodak's father. Zadok, Zadak, Zadok was Shalom's father. Shalom was Hilkiah's father. Hilkiah was Azariah's father. A lot of Azariah's. Azariah was Sarai's father. Sarai was Zehozadak's father. Jehozadak was forced to leave his home when the Lord sent the people of Judah and Jerusalem away. Through Nebuchadnezzar, the Lord called them all to be made prisoners in another country. Other descendants of Levi. Levi's sons were Goshen, Kohath, and Merari. The names of Gershon's sons were Libni and Shemai. Kohath's sons were Amram, Izhar, Hebron, and Uzziel. Marari's father, or Marari's sons were Mali and Mushi. This is a list of the families in the tribe of Levi. They are listed with their father's names first. These were Gosh- Gershon's descendants. Libni was Gershon's son. Jahath was Libni's son, Zima was Jahath's son, Joah was Sim- Zima's son, Edo was Joah's son, Zira was Edo's son, Jethrai was Zira's son. These were Kohath's descendants. Aminadab, Aminadab was Kohath's son, Korah was Ab- Aminadab's son. Asir was Korah's son. Elkanah was Asir's son. Ibiasaph was Elkanah's son. Asir was Ibias, Ibiasaph's son. Tehath was Asir's son. Uriel was Tehath's son. Uzziah was Uriel's son. Shal was Uzziah's son. Elkanah's sons were Amasai and Ahimoth. Zophai was Elkanah's son, Nahath was Zophai's son, Eliab was Nahath's son, Jeroham was Eliab's son, Elkanah was Jeroham's son, Samuel was Elkanah's son. Samuel's sons were his oldest son, Joel, and Abijah. These are Merari's sons. <clears throat> Mali was Merari's son. Libni was Mali's son, Shimai was Libni's son, and Uzzah was Shimei, Shimei's son. Shimei was Uzzah's son. Haggai was Shimei's son. Asai was Haggai's son. The temple musicians. These are the men David chose to take care of the music at the tent of the Lord's house after God's holy box was put there. These men served by singing at the holy tent. 
The holy tent is also called the meeting tent. These men served until Solomon built the Lord's temple in Jerusalem. They served by following the rules given to them for their work. These are the names of the men and their sons who served with music. The descendants from Kohath family were Heman, the singer, who was Joel's son. Joel was Samuel's son. Samuel was Elkanah's son. Elkanah was Jeroham's son. Jeroham was Eliel's son. Eliel was Toa's son. Toa was Zuth's son. Zuth was Elkanah's son. Elkanah was Mahath's son. Mahath was Amasai's son. Amasai was Elkanah's son. Elkanah was Joel's son. Joel was Azariah's son. Azariah was Zephaniah's son. Zephaniah was Tahath's son. Tahath was Asir's son. Asir was Ebiasaph's son. Ebiasaph was Korah's son. Korah was Izhar's son. Izhar was Kohath's son. Kohath was Levi's son. Levi was Israel's son. Heman's relative was Asaph. Asaph served by Heman's right side. Asaph was Berechiah's son. Berechiah was Shemaiah's son. Shemiah, Shemiah was Michael's son. Michael was Baasiah's son. Say that three times fast. Baasiah, <laughs> gosh, was Malkijah's son. Malkijah was Ethni's son. Ethni was Zira's son. Zira was Adahiah's son. Adahiah was Ethan's son. Ethan was Zima's son. Zima was Shimei's, Shimei's son. Shimei's? Yeah, Shimei's son. Shimei was Jahath's son. Jahath was Gershon's Gershon son. Gershon was Levi's son. Merari's descendants were the relatives of Heman and Asaph. They were the singing group on Heman's left side. Heman's left side. Ethan was Kishi's son. Kishi was Abdi's son. Abdi was Maluk's son. Maluk was Hashabiah's son. Hashabiah was Amaziah's son. Amaziah was Hilkiah's son. Hilkiah was Amzi's son. Amzi was Bani's son. Bani was Shimar's son. Shimmer was Mali's son. Mali was Mushi's son. Mushi was Merari's son. Merari was Levi's son. Heman and Asaph's brothers were from the tribe of Levi. The tribe of Levi was also called Levites. The Levites were chosen to do the work in the holy tent. The holy tent was God's house, but only Aaron's descendants were permitted to burn incense on the altar of burnt offering and on the altar of incense. Aaron's descendants did all the work in the most holy place in God's house. They also did the ceremonies to make the Israelites pure. They followed all the rules and laws that Moses, God's servant, commanded. Aaron's descendants. These were Aaron's sons. <sighs> Eliezer. <sighs> Sorry. Eliezer was Aaron's son. Phinehas was Eliezer's son. Abishua was Phinehas's son. Buki was Abishua's son. Uzi was Buki's son. <laughs> Uzi was Buki. Sarah Zerahaya was Uzi's son. Meroyas Merarios Merarios whatever was Zerahaya's son. Zerahaya Amariah was Merarios' son. Ahitub was Amariah's son. Zadok was Ahitub's son. Ahima, Ahimaz was Zadok's son. Homes for the Levites. I'm sorry, I know I mess up a lot in these types of videos, but I, I'm i just doing a one, once through because I cannot keep saying these names over and over. <laughs> 
Homes for the Levites' families. These are the places where Aaron's descendants lived. They lived in their camps in the land that was given to them. The Kohath families got the first share of the land that was given to the Levites. They were given the town of Hebron and the fields around it. This was in the area of Judah, but the fields farther from town and the villages near the town of Hebron were given to Caleb, son of Jephunneh. The descendants of Aaron were given the city of Hebron. Hebron was a city of safety. They were also given the cities of Libna, <coughs> Jatir, Eshtimoah, Halin, Debir, Ashan, Juta, and Beth Shemesh. They got all the cities and fields around them. From the tribe of Benjamin, they got the cities of Gibeon, Geba, Alimeth, and Anathoth. They got all the cities and the fields around them. Thirteen cities were given to the Kohath families. The rest of Kohath's descendants got ten towns from half the tribe of Manasseh. The tribes that were the descendants of Gershon got thirteen cities. They got the cities for the tribes of Issachar, Asher, Naphtali, and the part of Manasseh living in the area of Bashan. The tribes that were the descendants of Merari got twelve cities. They got the cities from the tribes of Reuben, Gad, and Zebulun. They got them by throwing lots. So the Israelites gave those towns and fields to the Levites. All those cities came from the tribes of Judah, Simeon, and Benjamin. They decided which Levite family got which city by throwing lots. The tribe of Ephraim got some of the Kohath's families, some towns. That made no sense. The tribe of Ephraim got some of the Kohath's families, some towns. Okay. Guessing that's a whoops on their part. Those towns were chosen by throwing lots. They were given the city of Shishim. Shishim is a city of safety. They were also given the towns of Gezer, Jachmim, Beth Haran, Aijalon, and Gath Rimon. They also got fields with those towns. Those towns were in the hill country of Ephraim. And from half the tribe of Manasseh, the Israelites gave the towns of Anur and Belim to the Kohath families. The Kohath families also got fields with those towns. Other Levite families get homes. The Gershon family got the towns of the Golan in the area of Bashan, Ashtaroth, from half the tribe of Manasseh. They also got the fields near those towns. The Gershon families also got the towns of Kadesh, Dabaroth, Ramoth, and Ganim from the tribe of Issachar. They also got the fields near those towns. The Gershon families also got the towns of Mashal, Abdon, Hukok, and Rehob from the tribe of Asher. They also got the fields near those towns. The Gershon families also got the towns of Kadesh and Galilee, Hamon, and Kiriathim from the tribe of Naphtali. They also got the fields near those towns. The rest of the Levites from the Merari families got the towns of Jachnim, Karta, Ramono, and Tabor from the tribe of Zebulun. Zebulun. They also got the fields near those towns. The Merari family also got the towns of Bezer in the desert, Jaza, Kidimoth and Mephath from the tribe of Reuben. The tribe of Reuben lived on the east side of the Jordan River, east of the city of Jericho. These Merari families also got the fields near those towns. And the Merari families got the towns of Ramoth and Gilead, Mahanaim, Heshbon, and Jazir from the tribe of Gad. They also got the fields near those towns. If you stuck with me this far, thank you very much. <laughs>